Given our app is kind of small and it's only going to have some text, we're going to use the section part of Bulma with a container. A container will kind of center elements in a page, which is notoriously impossible in CSS until things like Flexbox and others came around to do simply. Now you can just literally say class container and things are centered. And we'll designate it as a section kind of to have a block of our form and our content. And so when we go to Ellie, let's get rid of, let's, let's move this down for a bit. We're going to nuke pretty much everything we have here. And we're just going to say section. And it's going to fail when we try to compile that because we don't have section. So let's import the section tag from HTML.com. And inside of there, we want to have our div container. So we'll say div and give it a class of container. It needs to have the class on it so it knows it's a Bulma class. Save, compile. All right, so far so good. Now let's do our titles first. So we'll do an H1 tag. Actually, let's import both since we know it's going to fail. And this has a class of title. And so if I can spell temperature correctly, we'll say temper, temp, temp, temper, temper. You are from the South. Temperature converter. And the H2 is a class, I think it's subtitle, I forget. I'll have to go look at the docs. So the attribute is class, that's if you're not familiar with how Elm functions work, function, parameters. And in HTML's case, they always have two parameters. The div has some attributes that you add to it, and then it has contents, which is the second list. So it just takes two lists of things. And if you've done JSX, it look familiar, it's just instead of tags like this, you just use these, right? Pretty straightforward. Converting from Fahrun height. Is that German or is that Arabic? I'm not really sure. Converting from Fahrenheit to Celsius. And hit compile. Cool. So we now have a nice H1 with some text in Bulma and it's got some margins all set up. And our subtitle needs a period there. Just start typing.